Hi everyone, Rob Little here. I've gotten a couple of requests for information about the water filtration system that I put together for our CNC machines. So I thought I'd shoot a real quick video and put the links below to all the products and uh, show you what we put together here. So um, we pull our water uh, from the well into a 55 gallon drum. Um, that acts as a settling tank for some of the rust and particles that comes up. Um, and then uh, it's pulled from that drum with a pump. It's actually a pressure booster pump. Um, that pump is controlled with a liquid level switch, um, which shuts off, of course, when the bucket gets filled up. I, I do a one bucket uh, system. That way I can fill up a bucket, uh, mix in whatever I need to mix in, and then it just fill it up one at a time. I don't keep a whole lot of uh, filtered water sitting here, just five gallons at a time. So what happens is the pump pulls the water from the 55 gallon drum and goes into a UV light water sterilizer to uh, zap any bacteria or any algae that might be in the system. From there, it goes to a 10 micron particulate filter and to a five micron filter and then to a one micron filter. From there, it rolls on over here to a uh, a DI resin and then into a pH neutralizer and then of course goes into uh, into the bucket here and I use two types of uh, metal working fluids right now and uh, for the CNC's I use a pure synthetic castor oil, synthetic 9913 which is a fabulous metal working fluid for aluminum um, and a lot of the aerospace materials it's terrific but I can't use that in our new Haas 5-axis VF because it has galvanized way covers. So we have to go with the water-soluble oil. And that's uh, what we use here. We use a trim Microsol 692XT, which is also a great, a great uh, cutting fluid. So um, anyways, I hope that helps you guys. Any questions, uh, definitely message me. And I'll put the links to uh, all these products uh, below.